I'm Sally, and this is our last battle bit. For this one, we are reading Secret Coders by Jean Luen Yang and Mike Holmes. And this is a little different. It's a graphic novel. So it'll be kind of difficult for me to read and for you to really get what's going on. I'm gonna read a page or two and then I'll hold up the book so you can see the, um, the pictures that go along with it. So this is Secret Coders. Listen, I'm going to tell you a story, a story about me, but I'm telling you so you'll remember, remember about you. I wasn't all that thrilled about moving, but I downright dreaded transferring to Stately Academy. Drop me off in the front. Over the summer, my mom kept trying to convince me that it was the best school in town. No, I'm parking in the back. We can, I wanna walk in myself, mom, please. I didn't believe her, of course. She was blinded by her own reasons. Fine. I mean, think about it. Why would the best school in town look like a haunted house? Everything about it gave me the creeps. The trees, the birds, the buildings. Great, locked out on my first day. You, get away from there. Those doors aren't meant for the likes of you, you little hooligan. Even the janitor, especially the janitor. I'm sorry, I, the front entrance is that way. Go on, be off with you. All right, I'm going. Put that away before you pull a muscle, mister. I saw a group of boys on the lawn shoving each other like idiots. One was holding a basketball. My kind of idiots. Ahem, <clears throat> what's up? My name's Hopper. I'm new around here. You guys into basketball? Me too. Uh, the powder room's that way, little girl. Good one, Josh, huh? I was wrong. Not my kind of idiots. Idiot jerk faces. High five, Joshy. Bet I could take any one of them one-on-one. -on -one. Splat. All right, who threw pudding at me? Um, maybe the guy who's eating pudding, genius? Ha <laughs> ha, oh man, Josh, you're killing me. I could tell from the look on the kid's face that it was an accident but I didn't care. I was already having a bad day. My dad used to call Loogie's lung pudding. He was a funny guy. Spit, splat, gasp. <gasps> I got some pudding on my face, now you got some on yours. We're even. Right then I realized how big that kid was. And maybe we weren't so even. At least the stuff on my face tasted like chocolate. I got ready for a fight. Bring! Come on, you gonna let her get away with that, Eni? Eni? First day, we don't wanna be late for class. But in third grade, you gave me a bloody nose just for saying your mom, careful how you finish that sentence, Josh. The classes were even more horrible than I'd expected. History was boring, pre-algebra made no sense, but the worst was Mandarin. We spent the entire period repeating the same two phrases, over and over and over. I felt like some kind of robot, so I started saying the phrases in a robot voice. Man, it was hilarious, hee <laughs> hee. I'm pretty sure the other kids would have laughed too if they'd heard. They didn't, but Miss Hugh did. She gave me the stink eye for a full minute, then turned away without saying a word. Like I said, the worst. And I will stop right there. That is Secret Coders, the graphic novel by Jean Lun Yang and Mike Holmes. All right, thanks for joining me for Battle Bits.